Hello aviation enthusiasts, in our previous video we discussed the ICAO's Annex 7, which focuses on aircraft nationality and registration marks. This vital piece of regulation ensures that every aircraft has a unique identity, making it possible to manage and monitor global air traffic efficiently. In essence, Annex 7 is the birth certificate of an aircraft, detailing its nationality and registration marks. Now, let's shift our focus to Annex 8 the next significant chapter in the aircraft's life story. Annex 8 revolves around the airworthiness of aircraft. It sets the standards for design, production, maintenance, and operation of aircraft to ensure they are fit to fly. In a nutshell, while Annex 7 gives an aircraft its identity, Annex 8 ensures that every aircraft wearing its national colors is safe and sound. Now that we've refreshed our memory of Annex 7, let's dive into Annex 8 and its crucial role in aviation safety. Annex 8 the Airworthiness of Aircraft Annex has some fundamental objectives. It's all about ensuring the safety and airworthiness of aircraft. To achieve this, Annex 8 sets out meticulous standards for the design, production, and maintenance of aircraft. But it doesn't stop there. It also outlines the procedures for the certification of aircraft, ensuring that every plane in the sky meets stringent safety requirements. Moreover, it's not just about the aircraft itself. Annex 8 also covers the personnel involved their qualifications, and the facilities used in maintaining aircraft. It is a comprehensive approach that leaves no stone unturned when it comes to safety. This robust framework contributes significantly to aviation safety. It ensures that every aircraft you see in the sky has passed rigorous checks and balances. So, the next time you're on board a flight, remember, Annex 8 has played a key role in making sure your journey is as safe as possible. These objectives ensure that every flight you take is as safe as possible. How does an aircraft achieve airworthiness status? It all starts with the registration and certification process. First off, an aircraft must be registered with the appropriate National Aviation Authority, a process that involves providing specific details about the aircraft, such as its make, model, and serial number. Once registered, the next step is certification, a more complex process that ensures the aircraft meets the stringent safety and design standards set out in ICAO Annex 8. This involves multiple stages, from the initial application and documentation to the design and production evaluation. The aircraft design is scrutinized to ensure it complies with safety regulations, while the production process is assessed to confirm it consistently produces aircraft to these exacting standards. Lastly, the aircraft undergoes a series of rigorous tests and inspections, checking everything from the engine performance to the integrity of the aircraft structure only once the aircraft has successfully navigated this thorough process, it's granted an airworthiness certificate, a globally recognized seal of approval that the aircraft is fit to fly, and that's how an aircraft earns its wings, so to speak. But airworthiness doesn't end with registration and certification. The design and manufacturing of the aircraft play a massive role. Annex 8 of the International Civil Aviation Organization, or ICAO, sets strict standards for these processes. For instance, when designing an aircraft, factors like aerodynamics, structural integrity, and system reliability are all meticulously evaluated according to the Annex's guidelines. And when it comes to manufacturing, the story is no different. Every bolt, every rivet, every piece of wiring is produced and installed to meet the highest standards. An example of this in action can be seen in the production of commercial airliners, where stringent checks are in place to ensure every component is up to scratch from the smallest screw to the most complex avionic systems. And why all this attention to detail? It's simple. Safety. These rigorous design and manufacturing standards are there to ensure that every time a plane takes off, it's as safe as it can possibly be. These stringent standards ensure that every aircraft is fit for the skies. Once an aircraft is in operation, maintenance becomes key to maintaining its airworthiness. Annex 8 of the ICAO regulations outlines rigorous requirements for the maintenance and operation of aircraft. It emphasizes the importance of regular inspections, routine maintenance, and adherence to operational procedures to ensure the highest level of safety. Consider the case of a commercial airliner. Every component from the engine to the tiniest bolt is subject to strict maintenance schedules. These schedules are meticulously planned and executed to ensure that each part operates at peak performance. For instance, Engines undergo thorough checks after a set number of flight hours, while cabin interiors are inspected regularly for any signs of wear and tear. Beyond the hardware, 
The operation of the aircraft also falls under stringent guidelines. These include flight crew training, flight planning, fuel management, and even the loading and distribution of cargo. Every aspect is scrutinized to ensure optimal performance and safety. In essence, maintaining an aircraft is like conducting a symphony. Every instrument, or in this case, component, plays a crucial role. And like a conductor, the maintenance crew ensures that each part performs in harmony with the rest, resulting in a smooth and safe flight. Proper maintenance and operation are vital in keeping our skies safe. It's normal to have questions about such a complex subject. Here are some frequently asked questions about Annex 8. First, what is the purpose of Annex 8? In essence, it's all about ensuring the airworthiness of aircraft, which means making sure they're safe to fly. Second, who does Annex 8 apply to? It's aimed at aircraft manufacturers, operators, and maintenance organizations. Essentially, anyone involved in the life cycle of an aircraft. Third, what are the requirements for aircraft design and manufacturing under Annex 8? They're pretty comprehensive and include standards for structural strength, stability, and controllability, among others. Fourth, how is airworthiness maintained? This is done through regular inspections and maintenance following the procedures laid out in the aircraft's maintenance manual. Lastly, what happens if these regulations are not followed? Non-compliance can result in penalties, including the grounding of aircraft. We hope that clears up some of your burning questions. Compliance with Annex 8 is not just a guideline, it's a requirement. It's the backbone of aviation safety, and ignoring it carries serious consequences. Non-compliance can lead to aircraft being grounded, hefty fines, and in worst-case scenarios, loss of lives. Let's delve into some real-life examples. There was an incident where non-compliance to Annex 8's design and manufacturing standards led to an aircraft's engine malfunctioning mid-flight. Thanks to the training and quick thinking of the crew, a major catastrophe was averted. In another instance, strict adherence to Annex 8's maintenance and operation requirements detected a critical fault during a routine check. This proactive compliance potentially saved hundreds of lives. These stories underscore a simple truth. Annex 8 isn't just a set of rules, it's a lifeline for the aviation industry. Non-compliance is not an option when lives are at stake. The world of aviation is always advancing and so must Annex 8. Like any progressive framework, Annex 8 is subject to regular updates. These updates are not arbitrary. They reflect the evolving needs of the aviation industry as technology advances and as we learn more about what it takes to ensure the airworthiness of aircraft. Recently, there have been significant amendments. For instance, there's been a stronger emphasis on safety at the state level, promoting safety management systems and state safety programs. We've also seen the introduction of provisions for safety data collection, analysis, exchange, and protection. These changes have implications for everyone in the aviation industry, from aircraft manufacturers to service providers. They guide the design and manufacturing of aircraft, streamline the registration and certification process, and shape the standards for maintenance and operation. But they also have a broader impact. They help make air travel safer for all of us by ensuring that the planes we fly in meet the highest standards of airworthiness. Keeping up with these changes helps ensure the continued safety of air travel. Annex 8 doesn't just affect your local airport. It has a global impact. This document reaches across borders, ensuring that aircraft everywhere meet the same stringent standards of airworthiness. From the skyscrapers of New York to the vast plains of Africa, every aircraft taking to the skies is subject to the rules laid out in Annex 8. This global reach is crucial for safety. When you board a plane, you want to know it's safe, no matter where it was manufactured or registered. Annex 8 gives you this assurance. It ensures that an aircraft from Canada is just as safe as one from Japan or France or Brazil. But Annex 8 doesn't just keep passengers safe. It also helps the aviation industry operate smoothly. By creating a consistent set of rules, it allows airlines, manufacturers, and regulators to all speak the same language when it comes to airworthiness. In the end, Annex 8 plays a vital role in maintaining the safety of the global aviation community. Its influence extends to every corner of the globe, making our world a little safer every day. In conclusion, Annex 8 is a pillar of global aviation safety. It serves as a compass, guiding the aviation industry towards maintaining the highest standards of airworthiness. It ensures that every aircraft soaring through the sky has undergone rigorous testing adheres to stringent design and manufacturing standards, 
and is operated and maintained with utmost care. Annex 8 is not just a set of rules, it is a commitment to safety and excellence. It is a testament to the tireless efforts of countless individuals working behind the scenes to ensure that every flight is a safe journey. But remember, the world of aviation is forever evolving. As we continue to push the boundaries of technology and innovation, Annex 8 too will adapt, setting new benchmarks for airworthiness. And as responsible members of the global community, it is our duty to stay informed about these changes. So we encourage you to keep learning, keep asking questions, and keep striving for a safer sky. Head over to the ICAO website for the latest updates. Join us in promoting a safer sky for everyone. Until next time, safe travels.